We just got to play in the mud with the elephants. If you can't tell, we got a little muddy ourselves. <laughs> My face was muddy. I fed an elephant. This is such a magical experience and I will never forget it. So today is the day that I have been waiting for our whole entire trip. This is the day that I've been looking forward to. It's gonna be such an incredible experience and I'm so excited. Today, we are going to play with the elephants. We get to give them a mud bath and feed them and swim with them and oh my goodness, like all of my, yes, and mud. Um, all of my childhood dreams are coming true right now. Like today, this is it. It's gonna be the best day ever. I'm so excited. We're gonna go play with elephants. And the elephant kiss. That's what she wanted to do. Dad, you want the whole to get elephant kiss? Sign to little maybe. So it's kind of a long trip to get up to uh, where the elephants are at. Um, we're currently waiting on our van to pick us up. And then we have about a two-ish hour journey to get there. Um, which hopefully won't be that bad, and I believe it's supposed to be a beautiful drive. So we have made it to the uh, Karen village where we are hanging out with the elephants for today. They've uh, given us some traditional uh, clothes, um, traditional to the Karen tribe. And here are the elephants. You need extra food. We're feeding them. Woo! <laughs> mm, good Did job, it. buddy. Can I feed the baby? You want to go find the baby? Okay, let's go yeah, find the baby. baby. They eat about 10% of their body weight, um, so that's about 700 pounds of food per day. <laughs> oh my goodness, this is so amazing. These elephants are incredible. It is so much fun. I'm trying to feed the baby. And they're all really hungry, so they just want all the food. It's so, so, it's so cool. <laughs> So the girls are filling up the elephant's trunk with uh, a garden hose to give them a drink and then the elephant sprays the water into its mouth to drink. It's, it's kind of hilarious. Also the sound effects are really funny. That is so cool! And now we're going to go for a uh, one hour walk with the elephant. Um, there's a baby that's only about a year and a half old. I want to walk with the baby. So it's really cool to uh, get to see the baby elephant and uh, actually go for a walk with them. So as we're walking, we have to watch out for their backside because apparently their tails are super strong and uh, will mess you up with their tails. Also, the baby will kick, so we constantly have to watch out for that. Playing soccer. This is crazy. <laughs> Good job, baby. <laughs> Good job, Alexa. Kiss on the mouth, Mommy. You can give it a kiss on the mouth. Don't no. no kiss your cheek. It's strong. <laughs> oh, she kissed him. <laughs> <laughs> kiss him again. No. No. Oh, no. beautiful. <laughs> 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 Okay. 
Over here? Okay. Oh, wow. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. <laughs> <laughs> Do not touch the back side. Yeah. The front side. You have to follow directions. I, I thought I was on the front side. I'm in here. I'm in here. Put it low. Like this. So she can see it. Yeah. So we just learned that um, a lot of these elephants are rescued and that's why they're here at this uh, nature preserve. Um, some of the elephants are blind, uh, some of them have broken feet from stepping on landmines. And uh, a lot of them were actually rescued from the tourist industry um, because they are bred and trained to ride. Um, which is not that bad for them, but the problem is, is that the conditions that they're kept in are terrible. They'll be beaten with hammers if they don't uh, cooperate, uh, beaten with hammers just to train them. This preserve has purchased a lot of the elephants um, to get them out of that industry and are allowing them to uh, have a better life here. I fed an elephant. They're really hungry. He's giving himself a belly rub. <laughs> the nice thing about this group that we're on is that the elephants just get to roam around uh, in nature, walk through the forest, and we get to actually go on a trek with them. And we stopped at this little uh, watering hole for them to take a little bit of a mud bath. This is amazing. Nugget. Nugget. <laughs> Later. Later, buddy. So we've had an amazing morning playing with the elephants. They are absolutely incredible. Um, they're gonna have some time by themselves. We're gonna go eat some lunch, and then after lunch, I think we get to give them a mud bath. So I'm pretty excited about yeah, that. We're gonna take a mud bath too. Chloe's really excited about the mud. She wants to take a mud bath. She was seeing the baby playing in the mud and wanted to jump right in. But it's not our time yet. In a little bit, it will be. After lunch, we get to play in the mud. Mud keeps the elephants. Cool. I think it's raspberry juice. Yeah. What do you think the cup's made out of? Coconut. Should I try it? Yeah. Okay. Here, you hold the camera and you point it at daddy. Don't let go, okay? <laughs> I'll give you one hour. <laughs> one hour for one coconut. <laughs> Some people like it, some people don't. Don't like it? <laughs> I think it's too heavy. We're doing an elephant cooking class. Come in. How hard? Smush, smush, smush. We're going to make some food for the elephant. Put a turmeric to help. Good job. So we are having a little elephant cooking class. We're making some medicine for the elephant. Um, apparently um, elephants lose their teeth at about 60 years old or so. And living in the wild after they lose their teeth, um, they just end up dying because they can't uh, eat and they need to eat about 10% of their body weight per day. Living in captivity, they're apparently able to live longer because of this medicine. So we're making up some medicine for the elephants. Like this? Here. Make it into a ball. Anybody want to test? You can test. <laughs> Try new one now. All right, so this is made out of rice, tamarind, and sugar cane. And what else? Banana. Banana. Salt. It's like a Salt. granola bar for a, yeah, an elephant. I so. Girl, so it's a little different. <laughs> oh, and salt. It's actually quite salty. 
Yeah. You know what you know for? Apparently, I'm the first one to try it. <laughs> he told me to I could eat it. Who wants to All right. Try it? <laughs> now. <laughs> So we have our medicine balls that we made up. We have some fruit that we're bringing back to the elephants and we're headed back to uh, feed them and uh, take a mud bath with them. Yay, girl. <laughs> I will get your cup. We just got to play in the mud with the elephants, give them a little mud bath, and if you can't tell, we got a little muddy ourselves. I don't even know what my face looks like right now. It's probably covered in mud because Alexa and Chloe had a great time flinging mud all around. They're completely covered. Um, the elephants are covered. It's absolutely amazing. A dream come true. This is a once in a lifetime experience, and um, yeah, it's just been such an incredible day. When you're busy growing up, know that I'm right here. But everything is messed up, and it feels like no one. So these are my new best friends. I have always loved elephants and today has just been absolutely incredible. This has been just such a magical experience and I will never forget it. I'm gonna give them some bananas. These elephants are hungry. Get us out of here, <laughs> Time to say goodbye to our friend here. And I'm so sad I don't want to leave. I think maybe we'll have to come back here soon. I want something to eat. Bye bye. I love you. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye bye. He just peed in the mud, and now we're gonna get in it.